Welcome guys to another episode of Sky Wars. Did you see what I did there? We're doing another one of these today. Um, Block Party like kind of released publicly today or yesterday. I don't remember when. Nice pearl by the way. I don't know what I'm going to do with it exactly. Or it's probably going to be better for streams and stuff. Why am I saying this? I said this last video. But yeah, it's pretty cool. I might mess around, max it out or something. I don't know. But the premise of today's video is um, I am not a huge fan of bugs. And half the video is going to be me ranting about flies because they are the absolute scourge of the earth. So immediately I want to jump to saying flies are just use a useless species they do nothing for this planet and you know i'll admit they have a little bit they they contribute a little bit they um they decompose garbage and um i think that's about it oh no they also provide food for other insects like spiders but other than that they don't do anything they literally exist to just annoy people and you want to know why because these little guys they have brains that are like the size of a light particle they, they are they are stupid they don't have a sense of telling oh this, there's this giant thing that's trying to swap me out of the air i'm gonna keep flying around it until i die or i don't know if you ever you guys have ever gotten like a lot of flies in your home and you put up those like wall fly paper things or whatever if, they, if a fly sees like 70 of its dead homies on that thing it's it doesn't have a sense of oh dead things that means danger no they they just fly right into the paper and honestly that's probably beneficial because if they were smart it would be harder to kill them but since they're so dumb it, it's easy to get rid of them but sometimes when you're unprepared when you're just kind of chilling they don't like to mind their own business they just continue to fly around you and they're very annoying and why would you give a creature this dumb why would you let them be able to see in slow-mo that makes no sense i'll say it right now i am afraid of like 98 percent of insects on this planet but some of them some of them are actually quite nice like like ladybugs and butterflies they're they're fine they're not annoying they're pretty and they don't have any negative effect that i know of i'm not even really scared of flies i just really hate them because they're extremely annoying and they don't mind their business oh 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 i'm the go How do you like the low ground? Edits on YT. Uh, this guy's a Fortnite player. Alright, this is... Alright, I'm <laughs> getting sidetracked by comboing people. Anyways, other than those, I just... I hate everything else. I don't know. Like, e even dead or dead or alive, I cannot stand any sort of bug. It just... It really just creeps me out. And since a lot of people are afraid of spiders, like a lot of people have arachnophobia, that is just... That is just amplified for me. If I'm scared of every insect, I'm gonna be scared of spiders much more. I hate spiders. I don't want to see them. I <laughs> just get them out of my sight. And in fact, let me let me tell you guys about this. The most ultimate 1v1 I've had with a spider broke. Come on, man. <laughs> It was late at night. I was getting ready to go to sleep. This was probably after a long day of playing Minecraft. Maybe back in the Technofresh days in early 2021. I don't remember. Why is this guy connecting from the asteroid belt? Okay. I'm getting into my bed and you know what I see on the ceiling? Not even like, not even just the ceiling. It's kind of like, you know, where the ceiling and the wall meet, not the corner. You know, it was kind of just chilling on one of those and it was right above my bed and I did not feel like sleeping because, I mean, that's pretty self-explanatory. So... What do I do in this situation? What should I do in this situation? Should I just like go hit it with a shoe or um oh yeah uh what's poppin' Sifomi? Um this guy's like the hive skywars go. I'm gonna spleef him, he's gonna walk in a hole. No, don't stumble me off. Oh no. Every time every time anyways i was not going to lose this 1v1 with the spider all right i chose to get decked out all right i got this huge hoodie this guy is also connecting from the asteroid belt i got this giant hoodie i got a pair of winter gloves i got some nice sunglasses i also got a mask you know the ones people were wearing during the covid technically still now i grabbed a shoe from the floor of my room and I was ready. And there I am, calculating every scenario, every possible way this could go, just to make my chances of winning the highest. Eventually, I build up the courage to go up to that spider and hit it with a shoe. It's right under the spider, and boom, there, I just put my shoe there. I hit it with the shoe, and I hope it dies. And I'm thinking, oh, that wasn't so bad. But no, 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 that's not it. After I think I've won, the spider crawls from under the shoe. And I think to myself, this spider has ultra instinct. There's no way. How did you, how did you fall there? In that moment, I decide to retreat and the spider falls somewhere like on my bed or something. I, I don't know where it went. I think I slept on the couch in the night. But um, 
I, I, I don't know what happened to it. I don't think I killed it. I think it just kind of dipped out of there. I, th I think it may have decided, you know what? I'll be nice. I'll be nice and leave them alone. And that's about it. But I've, I've seen a lot of spiders in the households that I've lived in. Some of them like to, some of them like to guard certain areas and I will not go past that area because there's just like a giant spider hanging on the wall and I don't, I don't like it. Does anyone want the texture pack? It's called Nebula 16X galaxy recolor i think i found a pack that i'm gonna stick to also from what i've read i don't think i i don't think literally anybody cares but um i do so you're gonna see this pack a lot i used to hate this pack but now i really like it 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 now that i actually use it it feels so nice i i'm just like i kind of pop off every time i use it get out of here sweatsies lt you know there's also insects that i think are just naturally intimidating and i think everybody should be afraid of like 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 you guys have seen us you guys have seen a centipede be centipede before you know those long like caterpillar like insects but they have like a million legs yeah those things no 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 if i see one of those things i'm nuking my entire state welcome to another episode of national geographic with fresh the pig Today we have another Hive Skywars player in their natural habitat. This one's quite the unique case. Um, they've built a little bridge from one island to the other, except it's entirely underground. They ran out of blocks here, so they started using polished andesite. I don't know what he's doing right here. He doesn't see us. We're gonna have to we're gonna have to sneak up on him, get a closer look at what he's doing. I'm assuming he's in his inventory or something like that. Let's just stay behind. Let's let's observe what he does. Oh, he's here. Shh. Oh, he spotted us. <laughs> We gotta get out of here. He appears to be hostile. All right, we're just gonna we're gonna lure him out of his little uh, humble abode and um just. <laughs> uh, uh, we we had to put him out of his misery. <clears throat> uh, he had uh, some serious diseases. Another one I know would be cockroaches. Now, normal cockroaches, they're not that bad. They kind of just infest your home if it's dirty. They just they like to chill in dirty places. But the ones that fly, oh no, you, you gotta get out of there. You gotta, you gotta burn down that entire building. No, that's not even gonna kill it. Cockroaches are freaking, like, resilient. Way too resilient for their own good. I think they can, like, survive a nuclear blast or something. Like, that, those things are hard to kill. Behind you! You're about to get jumped! No, ninja games! Wait, wait a second. This is a true high flare. What the heck? He's fighting, he's fighting this guy. Bro's fighting a creeper. What the heck? Oh! Oh, that guy just got straight lined. Ants are one of those insects I've gotten used to just from seeing so much and encountering so much. But I think one thing I'll never get over is ant colonies. I don't know if you guys have seen before, but sometimes ants like to uh, gather in one spot for what whatever reason. And there's just like hundreds or thousands of them. Seeing them all grouped up in like the thousands just is extremely uncomfortable and unnerving. And I don't like to be near those, so I just try to avoid them. And just like that, victory, he fought- what is happening to my voice? Also, I realized I haven't mentioned any of the other pests. Those would be like, um, wasps and mosquitoes. Yeah, no, those are a big no-no. Wasps are the evil cousin of the bees or something. They exist just to cause suffering. They will just sting you if they see you. And mosquitoes, all I'm gonna say is just- just a few- just- just a select few people have died from malaria. Bro, think he dream. Hiding behind there is not gonna help you. <laughs> Oh, I'm an evil menace with the bow. What's poppin', Meg Gabriel? Y2, 942. Ooh, straight line. Hua, yeah, snowball. <laughs> he jumped off the map. <gasps> Honor boy. <laughs> you know, all this video, I've been pretty much talking negative about bugs, but um, I think my favorite bug would have to be the roly poly or the potato bug. I don't, it probably differs what it's called but depending on where you live they have a lot of names but i mean i i remember messing around with them all the time when i was little not not in like a not in like a bad way i meant like they're just harmless little innocent potatoes they ha they have this like black shell that they curl up into sometimes it's honestly adorable and you just like to they just like to be in the grass and the dirt or something uh that was crazy no don't live oh i'm so good at this game I just spent the last four minutes trying to find the name of this bug that I remember that like infested my home in the summer and it was really annoying. It's called an elm seed bug and in the summers sometimes these things like to just in like infest my room. I'll find like a ton of them, like 20 of them on the ceiling or something by my windowsill and my house it's not like messy or anything. It's not dirty. 
Oh, bro! Basically, it had nothing to do with my house. They were just really annoying. They didn't even do anything. I just didn't like the presence of bugs in my room. I've killed so many of them. And, um, luckily, they don't really show up anymore. I think the problem is resolved, but... Oh, boy, that was just terrible. Anyways, that's gonna be it for today. Well, this pack matches my skin. Um, you should subscribe and like. Sorry if this is kind of boring. I'm not too good at this anymore, but you know how it go. Moral of the story here, kids. Kill every fly you see.